Hey there all craft beer lovers, very much welcome you all are to a new beer review. Uh, going to take a, uh, take a look at a new brewery, but well perhaps not new to the channel because I have reviewed a couple of beers from these guys but from one of their subdivision companies called Prophecy Brewing. But the main uh, brewery uh, which, is, which Prophecy is a part of is of course uh, these guys. Brygghus 19 or Brewing House 19 in English. And for this one we're going for the big stuff, taking a look at their Galactic Boss Imperial Stout. Clocking in at 10% ABV as you can see there in a 473ml can or one pint sized can. Contains malted barley and lactose they say and that's it. And here's a look at the artwork. There you go, Galactic Boss Imperial Stout. With that said guys, let's get that top off, see what we get. There we go, so a little bit of uh, Impy Stout time tonight. Let's give it a good old center pour in the big glass here, see what we get. It certainly looks jet black. Oh yeah, there we go. Right, let's stop right there. So it generated quite the head. Right. Oh, I can get the smell now. There you go. Galactic boss, guys. What do we have? Three fingers worth of a nice, very, very kind of espresso colored head. Certain, a lot of small bubbles on top, certainly jet black beer on that pour, look at that, what a lovely presentation that is. It certainly looks the part like a big old imperial stout, 10% onto the nose. Yeah, molasses, sweet, dark roasted malts in abundance there, coffee. Almost like a smoked sensation on the nose, lurking about. Dark chocolate, perhaps. Oh, yeah, certainly that. Sweet, dark roasted malls, a little bit of molasses, dark chocolate coffee. It smells the part as well. Looks the part, smells the part. Let's get on with it. Cheers, all. Very well made, very well made Imperial Stout, Russian style Imperial Stout. You certainly do get uh, that lactose in there actually, so definitely a kind of a milk stout uh, approach to a Russian Imperial Stout. Lovely kind of sweet, very sticky and sweet uh, Imperial Stout. Sticks on the palate. Very sweet, that you get the lactose, a little bit of a slight vanilla vibe. You get a ton of sweet dark roasted malts, molasses in there, definitely a hint of coffee as well. Again, I like it, I like it. Mm. Mm. <sighs> yeah, again that molasses vibe. Little bit of maybe like dark fruits, like raisins in there, dates, figs, little bit of that kind of dark sweet fruits. I like it, guys. Uh, I like it. I've been holding on to this for a while, actually, but I thought, well, tonight's the night. I'm going to crack it open and review it. And boy, that was a nice one. Glad I did. Okay, so for me guys, uh, Galactic Boss, uh, Imperial Stout, lovely artwork, pretty cool looking. For me, that's a really fine Russian style um, Imperial Stout with lactose, so it's a milk stout uh, 
version there. 10%. You, I mean, I don't get the alcohol, guys. I don't get any alcohol at all. So it's a little bit deceptive there, a little bit of danger beer. Drinks like a 5 6% there, but it's 10%. It's smooth, sweet, sticky. Lovely, all the characteristics, if you like those things. If you like a good, really well-made Imperial Stout, lactose-inspired, everything. I would say give this one a go, guys. Lactose Imperial Stout, or Galactic Boss Imperial Stout with lactose from Brighus Nitton. Fantastic beer. I'm going to give it a solid 4 out of 5. Thank you very much for watching.